Sven. The internet's most beloved Minecraft dog. PewDiePie's had a lot of pets over his Minecraft series, but Sven is the longest living pet out of all of them. PewDiePie has even gone as far to say that if Sven dies, the series is over. Cancelled. No James Charles needed. The question is, how is he not dead? PewDiePie isn't exactly the ideal pet owner. Matter of fact, PewDiePie has lost many, many pets over the course of the Minecraft series. You want to see them all? Here they are. I gotta teleport Jurgen. No! Jurgen, get out of there! Jurgen, get out! No! Ah! Hey, water sheep. Time for pain. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Put you down. No! No! Oh no, bone cow! Damn it! Trying to get rid of the bone. Where did he spawn? In the wall? Ah! No! Oh, I forgot because there's a new skin. Sorry. How? I just hit him one. Bernie, we're too strong. Bernie! No! How do I splash you? No! No! Thank you, Bernie. But somehow, Sven is alive. The one animal that PewDiePie said if he dies, the series is over. And that animal is the animal that has lived the longest. It's not like PewDiePie keeps him tucked away in a safe room where nothing can happen to him. He's had his fair share of close calls. So is Sven really that lucky? Or is there something more to it? Is there something keeping Sven alive, somebody keeping Sven alive. Now, ever since PewDiePie spawned in potatoes for his pig army, people have speculated that he may have spawned in other things too. So, the first question that I needed an answer to is a very troubling one. Is Sven even Sven? Now, now, hear me out. A lot of people online are suggesting that maybe, just maybe, Sven has already died and that PewDiePie spawned him back because he didn't want to lose him that badly. The number one example is about when Sven was sucked underwater. The fact that Sven somehow ended up in that one cave and lived is just crazy. They mention that Sven is sitting when PewDiePie finds him and that means that he spawned him in. That's not really true. I did a lot of tests and it turns out that dogs will automatically sit after having left a boat and leaving water. But it still is a crazy scenario. Now, I remember being shocked during that episode. What are the chances? I mean, a cave in a perfect place where Sven happened to somehow end up in while taking no drowning damage. It all seemed so perfect. Now, that had me thinking. What if it's too perfect? We found PewDiePie's seed. We can go to that underwater ravine and we can find out if that cave that Sven survived in even exists. Did PewDiePie make that cave himself so Sven could live? Let's find out. This is it. Here, hold on. Let me see. I found it. Where's the Oh, and I found, the, I found the cave. I found the cave. This is where yeah, he goes, like literally. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is it. This is it. And this, this is, is the, the cave. Box. Like, this is the cave Sven went into. Come here. Where are you? TP to me. See okay. the pillar? And then he goes so down right here. Where... Yeah, this is it. This, this is, is it. The cave. That's why the angle is wrong. It's exactly where Sven so, was. And then the creeper. Does anything look off about the cave no. is that possible like could he actually get in there yeah like, i guess here? maybe he flew in somehow like like if like the render distance in. dude you see how lucky this would have to be yeah like, like 0.011 percent or something like how how can he go in that little cave like from 
legs. Get sucked down, must be moving perfectly. Because how does he get sucked in, though? I see the pillar, so but Sven's falling more away from the cave toward the pillar. Does that make sense? Like, he's falling yeah. on the opposite side. Sven's here, but how pillar's here. A... There it is. I want to go right over that. Pulling us down. Do it. I swim up. Ben. So when you're in the when the dog is in the boat, it gets pulled down all the way, like, like pretty much. Yeah, but did didn't Sven like fall out of the boat? Yeah, it's the same thing, but yeah. So the dog can last pretty long. It's dying now. It's gonna die. So what what had to have happened is that Sven got pulled down much lower than the cave and then bounced back up into the cave. Like walked towards it or swam towards no, it. No, like like yeah, pretty much yeah. But but I mean like got pulled down and then walked off of the magma cube cube block onto like the obsidian, and then swam upwards and got kind of sucked into the cave. I mean, so really that's like, that's like a zero point zero zero one. Yeah. Like that's such a small like the odds of that happening. Yeah, like Sven would have died. So you know one. 100 out of 100 times. <laughs> well, that's the thing. It's like it has to be a miracle. Mad luck. Like, absolutely incredible luck. After exploring the map itself, the odds of these series events happening are so astronomically low that it's more than a miracle. But everything points to the fact that it did happen. The cave is a real cave. The dog was sitting when the dog should have been sitting. If PewDiePie would have spawned in a dog, I don't think he would have sat the dog down. He would be thinking that the dog was standing, not understanding water mechanics. So everything points to the fact that this extremely rare event did happen. No cheating involved. So after confirming there was no cheating whatsoever during that episode, I went back and I watched every single PewDiePie Minecraft video that he has ever put out, and I simply watched Sven. I was looking for any possible sign that Sven was an imposter. There wasn't a single one. His collar color remained consistent, his sitting patterns were normal, his tail patterns were normal, his name was always there. So I can confirm with near certainty that Sven is not an imposter, and that this does seem to be the original Sven. Now that doesn't mean 100%, but it is 99%. So that begs the question, how is he alive? As background footage, I've been playing a lot of Sven's close calls, and as you can tell, there are a lot. A lot. He survived crossbow shots, creeper explosions, drowning, fall damage, and much more. However, there is one near-death experience that stands out to me. That near-death happened in PewDiePie's most recent video. A creeper surprises PewDiePie and ends up blowing up on the same block as Sven. Not only that, Sven was then launched into the air and took fall damage right after the creeper explosion. That's near maximum creeper damage and then fall damage on top of that. I just could not believe that Sven survived that, but there was no cuts in the footage and Sven lived. It did happen, but how? So I opened a survival world just to see if I could recreate the event. With the creeper in almost the exact same place, plus the fall damage on top of that damage, my dog died almost every time. Matter of fact, out of 300 tests, my dog survived twice. That's less than a 1% chance of survival. Now, that does prove that it could have happened. Although, the odds are so low that if it was completely legit, it's more than a miracle. It's just amazing once again. But that did have me thinking. In PewDiePie's recent video, he's been using a mod. Basically, a mod is something that modifies the game to make it work a little differently than it should. The mod that he's been using is a mod that has a PewDiePie boss and makes horses look like his chair and, and other modifications. Nothing that should affect Sven. Or so that we know. What if the person who coded that PewDiePie mod added into the code a line of code that made Sven invincible? Not wanting to see the series end, what if the coder secretly made it so that Sven could never die. That way PewDiePie would be uploading Minecraft forever. That would explain all of the recent near deaths that somehow Sven miraculously survived with near 0% odds. But 
We'll never truly know. Is Sven an imposter? Did Sven die? How is Sven even alive now? And that is the unsolved mystery of Sven.